have you ever seen somebody who consistently commits, you know, social posting suicide? Like what are the, what are the things just don't do this Oh, you know, or, or, you know, stay away from this. Um, you know, is there anything glaring that you can think of where you just go, um, this is, this is a swing and a miss every time, you know, how do you, 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 you want to try and stay away from that? Yeah. I mean, I, I think being way too formal, like treating your personal page, like a company page is a really like, it's not suicide. I think that might be overkill, but it's definitely not resonating. Um, I think also just taking something, copying and pasting it. I think a big one right now is copying and pasting AI. I'm not saying don't use AI to create content. I think there's a lot of value in using AI to brainstorm ideas, using AI to, uh, give you a different perspective on something, um, to even give you a good format. It's funny, but, right, you know, you say that because I'm, I try to be pretty thoughtful on, on, on posts that I'm writing and I'm always. I really am not. I've never done an AI post, but somebody commented on something that I thought was pretty great, and they go, "Oh, this is the perfect AI post." And I go, "What does that mean?" And then I thought, I think they thought I just mailed it in by just you know putting an AI and then posting. Yeah, it, and it's I'm, tough. But I, mean, I know, I now know what that sounds and looks like. If something sounds almost too good or word salady or whatever the, you know. Yeah, people are pretty good about understanding when something's AI or not. And it's especially hard fake, when- Right, they recognize fake. They they do. And I, I think at a certain level, there's things that you can get away with with AI. But I, for sure, one thing is right now, I think one of the worst features LinkedIn came out with was uh, you can comment by just like clicking a button and it'll generate an AI comment for you. And so you can just go around leaving AI comments on all these posts Yeah, and they're awful. And, uh, I just think that that's one way to commit like kind of the suicide on, on social media of no one wants to engage with you. Everyone thinks it's baloney and it just yeah. doesn't look good. So yeah. now, I think worse than not engaging is false engaging. So, so uh, good. don't, don't just copy and paste from chat GPT. It's, yep. it's not a good look. I think, you know, I was, before we were starting recording, I was looking at my Phone. I don't, are you mainly on your phone when you get on LinkedIn? Yeah, at least fifty percent, maybe more than fifty percent of the time. That's yeah. the advice. I've got a, you know, I've got the larger phone. It's I, instead of carrying a tablet, yeah. I'll carry that. But um, you know, I'm so still quite a bit on 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 LinkedIn fairly recently, and I think it's really well, everybody these, at this point. You know, I'm on one of these or the tablets. Oh, on, so in, on at, yeah. at least on the mobile. I'm not sure on the tablet, but I believe they've rolled it out to everybody. I'm not positive on this. At the bottom, you have your icons of like home, network, notifications. Yes. They've included the, the the tab for video now. Right. So it's essentially basically like LinkedIn professional TikTok, uh, if you will. And so now you essentially have this professional TikTok where really the floodgates are kind of open. Um, it's LinkedIn's still one of the very few platforms that's being posted on regularly. And there's so much opportunity there where Instagram's overcrowded, Twitter's overcrowded. Not saying that you can't grow on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook, but LinkedIn is definitely wide open, especially with the introduction of this video. So if you're interested in creating videos, uh, that is a really great place to be posting and you'll you'll immediately see an uptick in impressions and engagement. If you will go and just post videos, just how you would normally make a post, just post the video and it'll end up in that uh, TikTok side. And if it's in the right format, uh, meaning it's the, I think it's 16 by nine yeah. uh, or nine by 16, whatever your dimensions are, 16 tall, nine wide, uh, you will show up even more prevalent oh. inside of there. 